Hey, welcome to the channel. It's Fresco again. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you're coming back again, hey, welcome back. So today I'm going to talk about going to a car show. If it's your first time, you always want to go, maybe you're nervous, intimidated. I'm going to give you some tips and hints of what you should do before you go to make it really smooth and a great experience. Here we go. All right, so the first one I would say would be make sure you know that there's actually an event. So the easy way to do this is maybe look on Facebook or Google, or if you're out in the local car scene, ask around. And that, that's the easiest way to do it. Once you find out the actual event, then you just have to register. And normally it's on their website, or you can go to the Instagram page, and I'll have a link that you should follow to go to it. For an example, Clean Culture. They go all around the country. They do Daytona, they do Orlando, they do Miami. And I'm in Florida, so that's where they go. It's really easy. I go on their Instagram page and then I just find the link, sign up, and register. Registering is pretty much a straightforward concept. Just follow the steps, have a couple pictures of your cars, and enter. Number two. All right, number two, I would say make sure it's your kind of genre of cars. Um, I've made this mistake before not checking to see what genre it was, and it was a muscle car meet, and I bought the RX7. So it was a little awkward, still an okay time, but it was a little awkward. It wouldn't have been as good as it could have been if it was an import show. So do your research on the event, maybe ask around, go on the internet, look up YouTube videos on that event, and it'll make it a lot easier, a little more enjoyable. But if it's gonna be a bigger event, say like uh, this last weekend we had Tune Revolution, that's a big event. They're gonna have a lot of cars, so it's gonna be a big group of cars and a lot of diversity. So just do your research, and it should be pretty good. All right, and my final tip will be just go. Just go and get there. I know a lot of people get this point where they're like, oh, my car's not ready, my car's not show worthy. Just understand that you've worked really hard in your car and your, your build, and just show it off. If you want people to see it, just go. There's something for everyone. If you like it, someone else in the world will like it. You will be surprised the admiration you will get for your builds. There's a lot of times I've been to shows and I was like, ah, I don't know if my car is ready. And people have been just blown away. Um, understandably, I understand the cars I have, but even when this car wasn't ready and it was halfway done, just to watch the progression of where you're gonna be, and people just love love cars. You can share your interest with other people, and it's just a good time. So I would say just get out there and go. Enjoy. When it comes to winning trophies at these events, there's really no easy way to do it. Research is probably gonna be your best tool. So what I would say is research the category that you're gonna be in and kind of hone in on that. So for an example, I have JDM, so that's what I focus in on. I focus in on JDM, or if it's a drift meet, I try to bring a build that is more to that liking. If anything, I would go to smaller events and just get a feel for them. A lot of people will give you a hard time about winning trophies at events and saying that that's not what this is for, but you work really hard on your, vet, on your car and if that's what you want, that's what you want to do. Don't let them persuade you otherwise. Go to the event and win trophies. That's your thing. And don't let anyone tell you what you should and shouldn't do with your build. Just enjoy it, have fun, go to the event, and just have a new experience. That's all I got for you guys this time. See you next time. Drift day coming up soon, so hey, watch out for that. And you know, guys, take care. Like, subscribe. Until next time.